Welcome to the hottest movie review on the internet today, the A-List Review. I am your host, the Game Changer, Wes Troop, and it's time to go back to the theater. Will Idris Elba give us a movie that's the cat's meow? We're gonna find out my review of the 2022 survival thriller. Beast, coming up now. Recently widowed Dr. Nate Samuels and his daughters Meredith and Nora take a trip to South Africa to the Mopani Reserve for a vacation to reconnect with his daughters and learn more about their mother's cultural past. On the trip, Nate and the girls reunite with his old friend, Martin Battles, the reserve manager. They soon come upon a village where most of the inhabitants are dead and seem to have been mauled by a lion. Soon Nate, Martin, and the girls find themselves in the lion's path and hope they can get out alive. So what did I think of Beast? I thought it's an unremarkable survival thriller. It's directed by Baltazar Cora Makor, best known for directing films such as Contraband, Two Guns, and Everest. There are some thrilling action scenes with the lion chasing the characters and some decent tension. There's a brawl between Nate and the lion that's pretty brutal as well. The special effects look rather good, as the CGI on the lion looks believable. One of the film's biggest flaws is that it takes itself too seriously. If it took its B-movie schlock all the way up, it would have been more entertaining. Unfortunately, it tries to take some silly ideas and pass them off as believable. While male lions are protective and can be dangerous, it's a little over the top having the lion targeting and following certain targets like an assassin. While, of course, we want to see our heroes come out okay, I will say that I was definitely rooting for the lion when he was knocking off the poachers. <laughs> too bad they didn't throw in some of the douchey rich big game hunters to get eaten, too. The film gives us the, the familiar man-versus-nature cliches and doesn't do very much at all to stand out in the crowd. We also get the story of Nate's wife and the kid's mother passing away about a year prior, which turns things overly sappy and melodramatic slowing the story down while they are arguing about the family drama during the action. So many of the recent survival movies have the characters having to overcome some sort of personal trauma for some reason. The cast stars Idris Elba as Dr. Nate Samuels, the widowed doctor trying to make amends with his daughters, Iana Haley as Meredith Samuels, the eldest daughter who's argumentative and rebellious, Leah Sava Jeffries as Nora Samuels, the younger, more sensitive daughter, and Charlotte Copley as Martin Battles, the wildlife biologist who's Nate's old friend. Beast has some cool moments throughout, but it's too obvious and drab and doesn't have enough fun with its wild premise. Number-wise, I'm going to give it a 5 out of 10, which gives it the A-list rating of meh. You know, it's okay. All right, well, that's the show. I'll be back with another review very soon. But until then, don't forget to subscribe right here on YouTube. YouTube.com slash Westside of 515. Like the show on Facebook, facebook.com slash West Troop A List. And of course, you can follow me on the Twitter, Instagram, and Letterbox at West A List. Until next time, Troop. Out.